guess I'll start by asking you, uh, you know, you had you have, as I say, you did Stargate before and now you're doing uh, Nobility. What do you think it is about uh, science fiction that draws you in? Because it seems like it's, you know, something, a uh, trend that, that you, you know, in terms of your career that you've uh, done. Well, it's not just science fiction. Um, I, I like um, shows that, that not only have the gift of allegory, but also um, infuse humor in, uh, in situations that maybe on the surface aren't, aren't humorous. Um, and, you know, that's one of the things that I loved about Stargate was the ability to find humor in the most dire circumstance. And, you know, since I played Tilk, I haven't had the opportunity to um, play in, in, I'm perceived as not funny. Um, you know, but it's, it's, it's acting, you know. Um, and it, it's to be on a show that, that, that part of the framework of it it's not just sci-fi, it's also human. Each scene, uh, you sort of never know what you're going to get, and yet it sort of flows together seamlessly, which I love. Uh, and everybody, you know, there's some very serious characters, and there's some purely funny characters, and there's sort of a mix depending on the circumstances. My character in particular arrives being... Whoa! <laughs> uh, my character in particular, she's Lieutenant Ara Eris, and they call her The Weapon. Uh, and she is kind of a bulldog. She is ready to pounce at any moment if she feels threatened or feels that someone she is protecting is threatened. So she has less of a sense of humor and definitely less tolerance for the hijinks with uh, the nobility crew. But that makes uh, for comedy of its own. <laughs> All right, great. Uh, well, well, speaking of that, so would you say that the show you know, deals more so with a little more slapstick, or would you say that it, it, it gets its humor from you know, situational comedy about you know, with, with the characters? I would definitely say it's situational. I think there's there's not actually much slapstick to it, I would say. It's uh, it's all based on, well, what it is, is it's the awkwardness of a bunch of human beings being stuck in a very small space for a very long time. And so the nerves that get rubbed raw, the inevitable behavior that irritates one another and gets on each other's nerves. Uh, and when you're under a high pressure, high stress situations, all of that is heightened. So that's kind of where we're coming from. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. So I, I guess uh, the first question I ask for you is, uh, you know, is this your first uh, your first Comic Con, or you know, have you had a chance to, you know, do the circuit with with uh, other various cons? Um, my first con was uh, San Diego Comic Con last year, okay. um, and that was kind of crazy for me. Sure. It was like because I went to the biggest one first, right? And it just all hit me, and I was like, "It's too much." <laughs> and um, it was it was really hot, and I was really late getting here, and it was. It, and I, I came early. I came early, but ended up getting late, as you would always do, getting stuck in traffic. But then um, I loved it, and then I went to Kamikaze, and I, I went to some other ones as well, and I, I like them more and more and more. Once you get once you get used to the idea, and you know, everybody. What the the good thing is, everybody who's here is here to have fun. You know, so it's it's just all encompassing and it's great. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Uh, well, you know, I was talking to a lot of the cast and I was talking about you know how uh, this show Nobility you know deals with you know genres that you don't normally see married together too often. Uh, so can you talk about you know the challenge as well as the you know the the fun of you know m you know mirroring you know those various genres with sci-fi and co and comedy. Absolutely. Um, well, for me, my character is Sirius Salute, and I'm a stranger who comes on board the ship. So you pretty much through the pilot, you see everybody through my eyes. Mm. And I come on, it's, it's a great journey for me because I come on all happy and so eager. And as the journey goes along, a bit chipped away and chipped away until I am left with this sarcastic, sardonic person who I end up being. Okay. And, it, and it's great because I, with my character, I can explore lots of different things, and there's a journey, and there's so many different ways to play it. But it's it's difficult um, because it isn't it isn't because I think people are accepting of the fact that sci-fi and the comedy as well. Um, things like Galaxy Quest kind of played along that in, in a great way, yeah. and this is going along along that way. And like like Firefly did the same thing. There was the moments of the slapstick, and and they did it so well people took to it and I think that like the studio execs or whoever on uh, on Firefly were a, a bit frightened because it was this isn't usual sci-fi it's it, this is funny this, what what get rid of it get rid of it and it's uh, and I think people 
uh, ready for that now, and and it's great, and I love it. Cool, and I mean, I was there for uh, the panel just now, and you know the. Uh, reception, you know, is you know exceedingly positive. So, you know, what well, with other places that you that you've uh, had an opportunity to go to promote the you know show, what what has the you know the the reaction been? It's been universally fantastic everywhere we've gone, and it's building and building and building every time. It, it's it's kind of it's crazy because people are getting the idea, and what's better, they're liking it. So we're getting repeat people, and uh, and like the Twitter following is. Boomed. It's like over 10,000, 11,000, uh, you know, from something that's come from nowhere, from somebody's idea, and people have come on board from all over the places, from, from the crew to the designers to the cast, everybody. They're getting it and they're liking it. And, and it's, get, it's growing momentum more and more and more. And it, I just, I hope uh, that it keeps going because we've got such a great bunch of people, everybody, like the costumes, the cast, the, the, um, the set designers, the writers, everybody's working together and, it, and, it, and, it's, and it's gelling so well and it's wonderful to, to see this. It's really good. All right. Uh, well, I know you were talking just now, you're talking about um, uh, the experience of coming here the first time, you know, it was very overwhelming. Um, so if you weren't here, you know, uh, promoting nobility, you know, what, what would you say is, you know, something that you would be here uh, to see since it, you know, it deals with so many forms, this show deals with so many forms of media and, and pop culture. What do you think, you know, something that you would come here to see That's if you weren't? Adventure. Yeah. I would be here for so many different reasons. I grew up playing Dungeons and Dragons okay. and uh, um, AD&D and Warhammer 40k, reading, uh, um, I can't even think, um, Dragonlance and Forgotten Realms and Asimov and it just goes on and on. Wow, okay. I was a real fan and I, I would go around to my friend's house and we'd go and play a game for two hours and it'd be six hours later and uh, you know what I mean and the parents were like get out <laughs> go and uh, I, so I grew up I, I love this I, I love comics I love cartoons I still watch cartoons and my mom's like when are you going to grow up and I'm like never never and uh, so it, it, it's, it's, it's great I, I love comic, uh, comic con because like I said before it, it, everybody gets one another and, and somebody else said it in the panel when somebody goes, oh, my, my guilty secret is I, I like Doctor Who. And then 100 people around go, I love it. You know, you know so it's, you can have that and you're totally accepted. And I, um, I would be here for, what, what I'm seeing a lot from last year to this year as well is there's a lot of more TV presence here, which, which is, it, it's great. Um, and and we, I like the shows and I like seeing all, all of that, you know, as well. So it's good if it can all merge together so that nothing's been um, edged out the way, then that's even better. But right. I just, I just want to make sure that the true sci-fi fans and the, and the comic people are still good. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate You're your welcome. time, man. It's a, it's a pleasure. All right.